Hi, this is Brian Roman with Backpack Tactics. In our last session, we discussed how to use Microsoft Outlook as kind of a one-stop shop for all of your email accounts. Uh, how to pull in external email, um, our example was f from Gmail, into your Outlook interface. <clears throat> now, that's that's great, and it, it pulled in a bunch of things here, a bunch of uh, email messages, but it kind of leaves us with uh, a problem. Uh, sometimes it's useful to be able to distinguish w which email came through which account. After all, we probably have different accounts for a good reason. Uh, some of them are business, some of them are personal, some of them relate to different jobs, things like that. How do we keep them distinct? Well, there's a way to categorize this in Outlook, and I want to show you that today. Let's go to one of our messages, and you can do something as simple as you right-click on that and go to uh, Create Rule. Um, I'll show you another way to get to that. If you go to um, Tools, you can go to Rules and Alerts. And uh, sometimes it'll give you this little message. You may run into this message, you may not. And it's you know asking me, all right, there, there's a different set of rules or, or filters, you could also call them, on uh, this particular local version of Outlook versus on the server. You know, which one do you want to keep? I'm, I'm going to say server. And here, here's kind of our main box for rules and alerts. We're going to create a new rule. And here it gives me a, f a few different options. And I can choose from among these different ways to, to filter my email. So what I want to do this time is I want to designate uh, email that emails that come through a, a specific account with a particular flag. So what I'm going to do is click next <clears throat> and I'm going to look through this list here. There's, there's a lot of different options. The one I want right now is to say, okay, I, I, want, I, want, I want something to happen when an email comes from a specified account. And uh, You'll notice um, that you know here it, it appears down here as specified account. I can click that and then select the account. Oh, okay, there we go. That there's the one that I picked last time. My backpack tag at gmail.com. All right. When when something comes through that account, um, here's what I want to do. And then I have to click next. Um, move it to a specified folder. We could do that. You know, you can move it to um, a specific folder. You could create a, a, a new folder uh, in here. Um, let's say in my in my inbox. Okay, I want one called Backpack Tag. Okay, and then there it is. So that's one option. Let's go with that for now. Uh, you could do a lot of different things to it. Um, you can assign it to a particular category. Um, many different things. You can kind of look through this list. There's a lot of different um, possibilities. But for now, I'm just going to uh, move it to that folder. And click Next. And here you can set exceptions to the rule. Um, uh, oh, you know, if, if it's sent only to me, then I don't want it to go to that folder. Or things like that. Um, you can change. I, I don't have any exceptions for this rule, so I'm just going to go ahead and click Next. Then you can select a name for the rule. Um, I'm going to call this backpacktag at gmail.com. I'm going to put an arrow to backpacktag folder, kind of describing what it's doing. I can turn on this rule and I can also run the rule on the emails that are currently in my inbox. So in other words, I'm going to be organizing 
the stuff that I've already received, which is what I want to do. So I'm going to click Finish, and you can see this happening right away, right? You, you, you can see these emails moving. Okay, and it tells me, uh, keep in mind that this is only going to work when you actually have Outlook open. It's something that uh, Outlook does um, directly from the program side. It doesn't, it doesn't happen on the server. It happens on your program. So click OK. Say OK. That's great. Um, and if I look at my uh, folder list, I can see... Aha, uh -huh. look, I've got my regular inbox, which is what I'm viewing now, and then I have my backpack tactics folder, my backpack tag folder. If I click on that, there's all the ones that have been filtered. And it will continue to do that as I receive new email. So that's one way to keep your email um, separated and keep it organized while you've got uh, email from multiple accounts flowing in. This is Brian Roman with Backpack Tactics. Thanks for listening.